If you recently started breaking out over your back, skin, or face, and have noticed an increased amount of acne, cystic acne, or just haven't been able to get rid of your acne, then you are probably wondering the same thing that many are. What is the cause of acne and how do I get rid of it once and for all? Studies have shown that acne can affect between 79-95% to of teens and even up to 55% of adults so you are definitely not alone. Nobody likes the feeling of having a breakout no matter what their activity or who they may be interacting with for that day. Scientists have invested a lot of time into getting a better understanding of acne and have actually found that despite the larger number of adolescents going through acne as compared to the adults, the skin anomaly is a direct consequence of poor dieting. To show that acne is a byproduct of poor dieting, scientists went on to study a group of youngsters in societies that did not consume any processed foods. One group was the Kitavan Islanders of Papua and New Guinea, and another group was the South American egg hunter gatherers from Paraguay. In the end, not a single case of acne in both non-processed foods consuming groups was found. Out of all 1,315 men and women analyzed, not one pimple was detected. The sample even included 315 young people aged between 15 and 25, which is a primary time for acne. So with that being said, how exactly does a poor diet cause acne? Basically, when foods with a high glycemic index such as pastries, sweets, candies, and other processed foods are eaten, they are rapidly broken down into sugars or glucose for the body to use for energy. Glucose is handled by a hormone called insulin, but when there are higher levels of glucose due to the many processed foods in the diet, the body is forced to convert the glucose at higher speeds than normal which causes a spike in insulin. This stimulates IGF-1 or insulin-like growth factor which increases the amount of skin cells created. Additionally, raised insulin levels lower the amount of insulin-like growth factor binding protein 3, IGF-BP-3, which is responsible for controlling generation of new skin cells. So to sum up, a spike in insulin results in an overproduction of skin cells that block the skin pores which then become clogged with sebum and bacteria. Ultimately, this is what contributes to breakouts. A pilot study also suggests that dietary glycemic load may factor into contributing the pathogenesis of acne. Americans spend over $2 billion every year on acne treatments. If you have been using some type of topical or drug without success in clearing your acne, then this may be the reason why. The foundational cause of most acne is improper diet, and combining a good external routine or application along with a good internal regimen is key. In other words, we need to do a better job of getting to the root cause of the issue as opposed to trying to treat only the symptoms. In today's video, we are going to give you Nature's Crazy's top 8 tips for reversing acne and clearing your skin. 1. Supplement with brewer's yeast on an ongoing basis. Acne is ultimately caused by sebum and bacteria blocking the pilocybus pores. And brewer's yeast contains many essential minerals and B vitamins that help neutralize the bacteria and boost white blood cells thus hampering the growth of acne. A randomized placebo-controlled Germany study showed that brewer's yeast was effective in battling acne. 80% of the treatment group healed or substantially improved their acne over the course of the study. Supplementing with a high-quality brand daily will help aid you in your quest for clear skin. 2. Supplementing with a green tea extract called epigallocatechin 3 gallates or EGCG can do wonders for your skin. EGCG is a potent green tea extract that favorably alters the proliferation of sebum and other androgen hormones that give birth to acne. It has been shown in studies to help the body make better use of glucose and impede insulin resistance, which helps regulate insulin, IGF-1, and growth hormone levels. China has actually utilized green tea for years as a remedy for a multitude of inflammatory skin conditions, and it's now becoming more common in the Western world. Try supplementing with one or two a day, but make sure to pick a product that contains pure EGCG. We recommend Source Naturals EGCG. 3. Supplementing with vitamin E on a regular basis can improve the immune system and having enough in the body will make it far less likely that sebum will cause acne. A study found that people suffering from acne have an average of 10% less vitamin E in their bodies compared to other peers. On acne.org, 80% of people who used it for acne said that they would recommend it to a friend. Try supplementing with a good brand with an appropriate tocopherol to tocotrienol ratio. 
4. Using a high-quality probiotic daily will be very beneficial, especially for those with cystic acne. In many cases, skin issues such as cystic acne go side by side with some form of gut dysbiosis, and research has shown that people suffering from acne tend to have higher amounts of blood toxin levels that have been absorbed from the gut as a direct result. Supplementing with a probiotic can help you protect against increased bad bacteria in the body, along with correcting sugar metabolism and chronic inflammation. We recommend taking one to two capsules a day from a reputable brand on an empty stomach. Five, supplementing with zinc on a regular basis can greatly help you clear your skin. It is one of the most crucial minerals your body requires and helps naturally boost the immune system. In a three-month study, patients using 30 milligrams of zinc gluconate daily enjoyed an average of 49.8% reduction of pimples, and many patients enjoyed an improvement of over 66%. We recommend taking at least 15 milligrams a day. 6. Lactoferrin is a byproduct of milk protein that provides protection to the skin by creating an antimicrobial action that helps prevent the growth of bad bacteria on your skin, thus preventing blemishes. A study using lactoferrin showed it to be very effective in eliminating acne. 76.9% of the subjects showed reduction in total lesion count. We recommend 200 mg a day on an empty stomach. 7. Eating a healthy diet consisting of natural foods with a low glycemic index is needed to avoid insulin spikes. It's okay to splurge from time to time, but for the most part, try to avoid junk food and instead opt for lean meat, vegetables, sweet potatoes, and fruits. Tip number 8 isn't a supplement but a clear skin salve. It's crucial to use a topical aid when fighting acne. Your diet and supplements help the body from the inside out, and an effective topical gives you the chance to target your specific skin needs until your diet and your body's hormone level gets under control. If at all possible, try to avoid chemical cosmetics and products with harsh ingredients and opt for a natural topical cleanser that contains only beneficial ingredients. For this reason, we suggest using Nature Crazy's all-natural facial cleanser every morning and night. This cleanser contains powerful acne-fighting ingredients that are known to fight inflammation and dissolve the dirt and oils that contribute to problem spots while you sleep. A quick nightly and morning application can yield magnificent results. Consider pairing it with a good natural moisturizer and using regularly. These are the top 8 steps for getting your acne under control and thanks for watching!